Before 2013, you wouldn't have seen this lifeguard stand on Sandy Beach at Greer's Ferry, but there was a day that year when Barbara Owens made her son stay home and do his chores while a friend went up to the lake to go swimming alone. He came up here to swim after football practice. Um, about eight hours later, my son got the phone call that he had passed away in about eight feet of water. It really terrified me as a parent. I started reaching out to the kids. Uh, we got a petition signed. We took all the children before city council. They got the lifeguard stand, but little did Heber know these students were just getting started. For three years now, they have been responsible for a series of movies at the beach produced by this growing army of teen recruiters. We play movies for everyone to come together. They get to know each other and take time to have fun. The big picture is more than movies on the beach. They've mentored, staged benefit concerts, provided storm relief, and for the last two years have undertaken an intense anti-bullying campaign. I joined to help all the kids out there who didn't have a voice. I liked what they did, what they tried to reach out to do. I was raised to, you should always be courteous and you should always be nice to other people. And you should never like bring people lower than yourself. And I don't like it when I see people doing that. It has been a banner year for teen recruiters. Their numbers grow, the community has responded. And along the way, they learn valuable life lessons. People are like labeled. And if you actually take a minute and not label people, you can actually see that a lot of people are really nice. You can get really lost in, you know, what's going on in the world around you, but you can always remember that point during the day where you have connected with somebody. This chair on Sandy Beach has produced a lot of lifeguards.